snow. It can be beautiful, almost magical even, and inspire a sense of childlike wonder in us all. But it's also heavy, slippery, and a pain in the you-know-what to clean up. And at a certain point, a lot of people just get tired of it. Hurry up, spring. <laughs> I'm ready for it. Mark Gutzmittel was out earlier today with his trusty snowblower, clearing the snow for himself and his neighbors, and says the composition of today's snow made the job that much harder. This heavy snow probably takes me about 45 minutes. Yeah, it takes a little while. You gotta go slow. Gutzmittel is happy to help out his neighbors, but still hopes to put the blower away soon. Yeah, you know, you always hope you're gonna be done with snow by here, or maybe just a little bit, but... It's Wisconsin. For people like Lori and Al Schmidt, the snow is a secondary concern, though. We came to pick up some donation items. Our son um, was diagnosed with cancer back in September, and he is at the University of Indiana receiving chemo and a stem cell transplant. The Schmidts drove up from Sheboygan to help shovel the snow for Al's blind mother. They say they've received donations ranging from boxes of chocolates to an African safari to encourage their son through this difficult time. And the support they've received from their friends and neighbors makes them proud to call the Badger State home, bad weather and all. We live in a great place. We really live. Yeah, Wisconsin's awesome. Yes, Wisconsin is the best state ever. In Oshkosh, Seth Humanek, NBC 26.